And that's a big part of this challenge. And I just did a post on it here recently talking about this idea of like 75 hard and hard, hard, hard. And it's all about, you know, going hard and, you know, going all in, but it's about going hard in all the areas of your life. And so going all in with your family and going all in, you know, with your mind, your body, your spirit, your, you know, relationship with God, like all of these things I was going all in on during this challenge. I did a video last week and in the title of the video was the world deserves your best. Yep. And you can get all philosophical and talk about how the world deserves your best, but each of us have our own world, right? That's exactly right. And, and for us, our family is our world. And so our family is the one that deserves our best. They deserve our best. Because when we talk about success without fulfillment is the ultimate failure, the number one way you can identify that is when relationships are out of whack when you've had the financial success but your relationships are gone and I can tell you that there is nothing worse than being successful but having terrible relationships it's like well, what is it for like like what, what did I do all this work for what is noble about squandering squandering this finite period of time that I have on this earth with my family where is the nobility in that in the framework of the world deserves your best and the world being your family, like how can I leave on Sunday night or Monday morning and go work and not utilize that time to the fullest, knowing what I'm sacrificing, not risking, and what I'm sacrificing, which is time with her, and knowing that I have to put in 100% effort to make it worth the sacrifice. Yep. That's what it's all about, guys. Sometimes the hustle, the grind, it's all good. Uh, but man, family, family first. And it's about living every single moment and every single day to the absolute fullest. That's why I'm so big on this all in and all areas yeah. and, and just like screw this whole idea of work-life balance that everybody wants to have, that it's more about just going all in. There's two ways to balance a scale. One is taking away, which is the way most people talk about work-life yep. balance. If I need to, if I need to increase in one area, I need to take away from another area. Yep. But if you need to increase in an area, you can also just increase in that area. Yep. And there's so many other ways like sleep and like all the different leisurely activities that people do away from their families and away from work that a lot of times they're not willing to decrease Yeah, yeah. in order to increase the family time. This weekend is going to be the most incredible weekend with my 18 month old uh, daughter because I will be all in and squeeze every ounce that I possibly can from those hours that I have with her. And to me, that is the ultimate version of a man that has the ability to do so many different things, but has the ability to make you feel like you are the only person in the world when they spend time with you. You have to go all in in all areas and family first. 100% she needs me there. And when I'm there, I am 100% there.